Now, at this time of year, many of us are trying to be active, but no more so than a 95-year-old war veteran from Angus. Les Skelton was encouraged to take up golf after being injured in the Second World War and is now an inspiration to many. Ben Phillip reports. Well, that was a good one. That was a good one. It's a love affair that started 75 years ago for Les Skelton. The World War II tank operator was urged to take up golf to aid his recovery after having his shoulder blown off in 1944. An honorary member at his home club in Brecon, he has no intention of putting away his clubs. Why do you enjoy it so much? Oh, it's, it's, it's just you against the golf course. And uh, I, I just love it. That's all. It's such a friendly club. Everybody's friendly here, always has been and it's stayed that way all the time, it's great. Recent research found that people who play golf can live up to five years longer than non-golfers. The long walk and social aspect bringing a number of physical and mental health benefits. And for Les, who celebrated his 95th birthday last week, he believes it's the best prescription. I've done all right. <laughs> I've done all right. It's very good for you, bound to be good for you. Um, the, the fresh air, the exercise friendliness, laughter is the best medicine, you know. Despite formally holding a handicap of seven, he never won the top prize in the 50 consecutive Brecon Opens he competed in. But recently, the popular member had a trophy named after him. He's a remarkable man. Um, 75 years he's been a member, 95 years old, still plays golf twice a week um, with a friend of his, Ian Mowat. So, yeah, remarkable achievement and a great character in the club. Looking into the future, do you, do you plan to just continue playing golf? Oh, as long as I'm possible, able, yes. I'll maybe die in the golf course. <laughs> Les said he feels healthy, happy, but most of all lucky. A man adamant to continue walking these fairways for many years to come. Ben Phillip, STV News. Les, I think you're an inspiration to us all. That's it from Tayside this evening. Bye for now.